One of the campaigns subjected to information gathering, according to the report, was the Justice for Harry Stanley campaign. Harry Stanley was mistakenly shot dead by police in 1999. Now, Terry Stewart has been secretary for that campaign uh, ever since joining me. Now, let me just uh, remind our viewers what happened to Harry Stanley, shot by police in 1999. Police were tipped off that an Irishman was carrying a gun. Mr Stanley from Glasgow uh, was carrying a wooden table leg, which had just been uh, repaired. Um, how do you feel about the fact that you were under surveillance? Well, um, I think, first of all, I should say that the Stanley family are absolutely devastated by the news today. Uh, and the idea that uh, a, a small community campaign, such as the, what the Harry Stanley campaign was, very similar to all the other campaigns led by families, uh, organised by local community organisations, there's no reason why they should have been scrutinised. There were public events. There were Everything was open and transparent, but unfortunately, um, I don't understand why they, why they were carrying out this work. They talked today about about uh, collateral intrusion. I mean, you start using language that it means absolutely nothing. But the Metropolitan Police have apologised for for what's happened. Is that enough? No, I don't think it's enough. And uh, as I said before, the, the, the devastation caused by the families by the initial act of the killings of their loved ones, then to have to go through courts, judicial hearings, uh, inquests, what have you, and still got no justice from, their, from the, the loss of their loved ones. For them now to turn around and say that we have been under, uh, had you under uh, uh, surveillance, surveillance yeah. it's, 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 it's a terrible shock to the families and it's a deep, bigger shock I think to the rest of the community because if that's the way the, the, the police are behaving, uh, we're talking about a, a, you know, a country that prides itself in democracy and transparency in its police, not a, not, not a Stasi-like uh, operation which we were more akin to seeing in the Eastern European countries. Okay, Terry Stewart, thank you for your time uh, this evening, thank you.